My name is Namrata Kandula and I'm a general internist and a researcher at Northwestern University. My work focuses on the social and cultural determinants of health in minority populations and I'm specifically interested in the prevention of diabetes and cardiovascular disease. Wonderful. And so how has taking a community engagement approach affected your work here at Northwestern? So I think that's an important question um, on many different levels. Uh, I think the first for me is that it has forced me to look at um, a community's health issues through a completely different lens. Like often I would think about a community as a hard to reach community or you know, a disadvantaged community. And what I've realized is that these communities are not hard to reach. It's just that we don't have the language or the skills or necessarily the time to actually um, really understand what are the issues that they face, what are the things that they care about, you know, what moves them, what excites them. So they're really not hard to reach at all. And you know, if you have the right staff and you have the right skills, um, these are communities that are very welcoming and actually want to address many of these health issues, um, as well as address a lot of other things that are going on and, you know, they care about a lot of things. So that was the first thing is, um, I don't see people as hard to reach anymore. It's more like, what can we do to work with this community? Perfect. And so, and how, so how has CERC slash ARC helped you do that? Um, so I was a recipient um, with Metropolitan Asian Family Services uh, of a um, CBPR implementation grant and so CERC uh, supported us through that grant and helped provide funding so that staff at MAFS could actually devote some time to the research project because research is one of their multiple responsibilities. Um, you know, they're dealing with a lot of other things that they need to take care of. So it sort of gave them protected time. It gave me protected time as well as my staff and allowed us to um, spend more time with each other, establish a relationship, kind of figure out our rhythm and how we're going to work and what are the issues that we care about. So. Sure. Cool. And, and so just more generally, why is it important that we conduct community-engaged research here in Northwestern? Because the solutions are not going to come from the university. I think we've learned a lot about sort of the individual determinants of health. We've learned a lot about the basic science, you know, of what's going on and causing a lot of these um, health problems, but we still haven't figured out the solutions. And I think that's part of that is because we need to really let some of these solutions come up organically from the community. And so the only way to do that is to engage with them and work with them side by side um, because the issues that we want to address, such as diabetes and heart disease prevention, are very complex. They're not just about the individual, they're about the social influences, the cultural influences, the environmental influences, and I, as a researcher, can't know about all of those things for everybody. Um, so it's really about partnering with other people who can teach me, help me with their expertise, and I can offer my expertise. All right, well, thank you very much. All right, thanks.